general manager for community partnerships. So, um, so you know, building relationships between footy clubs, local councils, um, local community organisations, and and seeing what we can come up with. Um, AFL Tasmania has been working in conjunction with Apricot Consulting to develop a pilot program we've, and we've uh, introduced it into the Hobart City region and we've had um, a bunch of kids from Taz TAFE and some representatives from the North Hobart, Hobart and Sandy Bay Junior Football Clubs. Uh, we got, got all the boys in on Monday night and they did some cultural sensitivity training and got to meet each other and have a chat and then we took them out on the field and the local junior footy club players uh, taught the multicultural kids from the Taz TAFE about how to play AFL nines. Uh, so they got out on the ground and had a, had a bit of a kick and a handball and some slightly more successfully than others. And, um, and it was just about sort of a cultural exchange and an opportunity to meet people they might not normally get to meet. Community engagement is probably the next big area for football clubs to get involved in. Um, I think traditionally there's been a bit of an attitude uh, from footy clubs about, well, what can the community do for us? And we really want to, we really want to get into a space where clubs are saying, well, let's be community leaders and let's find out what we can do for our community. You know, what are the issues that are affecting um, local people, um, new people to our areas, and how can we become really valuable community citizens? The feedback we got from afterwards, we had a barbecue with the boys and you know they were all just having a chat about, you know, some of them had never met someone from um, such a, you know, or had never met kids from such uh, diverse cultural backgrounds and sort of hearing their stories about how they came to be in Australia. There were, there were boys from Iraq, Bhutan, uh, you name it and um, it was, I think, a really valuable learning experience for them but also, you know, just using footy as a vehicle, it wasn't about learning to really play, it was about, you know, how to meet people, how to be inclusive and how to have, um, you know, how to have a good time.